When Matt DeWar stepped up to the plate, Jake Andrews said, sure, I'll give you a title shot. You say you're the best at an alternative promotion. I can beat you. And now the two are going at it. This is our final match here this afternoon. I'll tell you what. Here we go. Battle Royale. Is we, that true? No Battle Royale today, uh, but this we're going to enter right here with a championship match. It ain't going to get any better than this. Big kick to the sternum by Jake Andrews. Jake Andrews, the fighting champion. He said he would defend the title against anybody. And when Matt DeWar stepped up to the plate, Jake Andrews said, sure, I'll give you a title shot. You say you're the best in an, an alternative promotion. I can beat you. And now the two are going at it. And Matt DeWar showing his athleticism, manages to get out of the fireman's carry and drop toe holds. Jake Andrews head first in the middle turn before hitting the neck breaker. You gotta be impressed by both of these young athletes. I'm impressed, they're young, they're both hungry, and they both want it. Defending champion, the hero of all, Jake Andrews. But Matt DeWar's got a heck of a fan base behind him. In a very short period of time, in just one match, he's opened up some eyes against Pretty Boy Floyd, and the rematch is set to go down September 2nd. So Mr. Ricklow, I mean, if DeWar wins here, wins the title, does Pretty Boy Floyd get the next title shot? Well, it's a good possibility. We'll have to take it up to the powers that be, but I'll tell you what, either way, Pretty Boy Floyd is going to have his hands full. Power slam hooks the outside leg and almost put him away right there. Global professional wrestling with the Cancer Support Center. Lots of donations have been circulating throughout this afternoon, inside and the outside of the American Legion Hall for the RC benefit ride. Do you like to ride motorcycles yourself, Mr. Rickolo? Not hardly. Well, I've seen a lot of individuals revving engines all over the place, and we're hearing rock and roll all over town. And it is a celebration right here. It is celebration. Well, today, all proceeds will benefit the, the cancel fund, which is really a great cause. Mr. Rickle, I have you right here on commentary. Gotta ask you a question. You, Charlie Jr., is it on September 2nd? Well, I don't know. Um, well, I can say this. If he gets in my face, or if any of those guys get in my face, I've got the family and I got myself. Charlie Jr., what can I say? He's a punk. Running clothesline, and he almost beat the champion right 
there. Well, earlier today, the family, represented by Braun the Lumberjack, you, you seemed like you were in good, you, were, you seemed like you were very positive and confident that you could handle it. I think that you had some numbers behind you today. Well, when you when you're dealing with the family, there's always that there's always that threat. There's, there's, you're always going to be scared. You, there's always going to be something because the family you just can't trust the family because you don't know what they're going to do next. You don't know where any of these guys are working, where they're hiding. Man, could have been behind the truck. Who knows? Now I want to ask you a question because you have been in the ring more than once this afternoon. You consider the high temperature outside and then the temperature in the ring. Is it that much hotter in the ring than out of the ring? Oh yes, you better believe it, it's hot in that ring, baby. So for the that, action is hot. So for that reason, you take a fall in this ring, your skin will be scorched as Matt DeWard has the upper hand on Jake Andrews on the far side. DPW Championship action right here. Watch out, DeWard has Jake Andrews seated on the top rope and support. And this is one of the signature moves of Matt DeWard. Will you hit a multiple mega ball? Impeccable superplex off those ropes. Andrews won't go as he tries to fire away. Will Matt DeWar fall? He's holding on barely with his fingertips in his right hand. Andrews has caught him. Oh. Sit down, power bomb, and both men are down and they both have their heads scrambled. So then you combine the effect of being driven down on the mat, having your head being in that collision, going 20, 25 miles an hour down on the mat, and then you combine that with the high temperature, Mr. Riccolo. You gotta be a tough sucker if you're gonna endure these well, elements. Well, that's why these guys train four to seven days a week. They have to be in shape. Even when you're in shape, I don't care what anybody says, but when you get slammed to the mat, it hurts, and you should know that. Right kick as he prepares, slingshot spear, Jake Andrews, one of his signature moves, could he have gone for the cover right there, he did not, high fly knee smash, no, back to war, moved out of the way, as he tries to cinch him in, slice spread over the shoulder neck breaker, we could see a new champion, oh he got the shoulder up, this match is still going down, global professional wrestling championship match, He avoids the contact. Racing shot to the shoulder and the back as Andrew stands and prepares. Fly knee smash! Matt DeWar is out cold! Jake has retained the title! What a huge victory as Jake Andrews continues to reign supreme 